Good evening, I'm Archbishop Walter Dixon, and this Sunday, July the 24th, 2011, I and First Lady Nyoka Dixon had the distinguished honor and privilege to be guests at Peace Baptist Church, where Pastor Tyrone E. Barnett is the senior pastor, located in Decatur, Georgia. And my brother in Christ, Pastor Barnett, I want to personally thank you and your congregation on behalf of First Lady Nyoka Dixon and I for the love shown to us at Peace Baptist Church. I want to thank you for allowing me to bring this morning closing prayers to the congregation. Your text was taken from Song of Solomon, chapter 1, verse 5 through 17, titled Oasis. And you talked about how Solomon truly thanked God for providing his soulmate to him. And in this chapter, Solomon reflected as to how each individual in a marriage should love one another. And you mentioned the five C's, which are celebration, conflict, checkbook, calendar, and Christ, and how they relate to a marriage. The congregation was taught that in a marriage, each spouse must nurture and encourage each other. You shared how each person in the relationship has a vital role to play in that marriage couples shouldn't mind doing the corny or simple things that make each other happy. I appreciated you explaining the word lust to the congregation and letting them know this is a desire that one spouse has for the other to be like someone else. This behavior is not healthy and we should immediately change our definition of beauty. You stressed, while it is desiring for a spouse to hear kind and thoughtful words from one another, it is important to realize that you must be connected and committed to each other's heart, soul, and mind. And beauty is beautiful, but it is only something that shines from the exterior of our body. True love must come from within each other's heart. My wife and I enjoyed the way you shared how the standard of beauty changes and we must all adjust to that standard and find it within our spouses if we want long-lasting, fruitful marriages. True love bears all things. It is a love testimony and selflessness when Christians don't discard their spouses because of cancer MS or any other disease that may plague this physical body of ours. Truly this is the example of Jesus Christ in this earth. My brother Pastor Barnett, we must believe and trust in God more to take care of us when we are confronted with trials and tribulations in our relationship and marriage. If we put into practice the five love languages which are gift physical touch, words, service, and time. The world will begin to see Christ like marriage and want the Jesus that Christians have. If I can ever be of any assistance to you at any time, please feel free to contact me. May God continue to bless you and the members at Peace Baptist Church.